Michael, how are you? I found something really interesting. The whole housing market is propped up on these bad loans. They will fail. The housing market is rock solid. It's a time bomb. So Mike Burry, who gets his hair cut at Supercuts and doesn't wear shoes, knows more than Alan Greenspan. Dr. Mike Burry, yes, he does. <laughs> I'm going to start by saying this movie is fantastic. Uh, I do agree. Adam's done a phenomenal job, isn't he? Phenomenal. Yeah, thank um, you for saying. Uh, when you think back on the making of this movie, is there a day or two that you're always going to remember? Uh, you know, um, it, it's going to be um, meeting with Mike Bowie, uh, the, the, the the real man, during, during the research. You, you get these ph phenomenal... Um, uh, uh, opportunities to uh, talk with um, people in a uh, manner which would never be allowable, would be kind of sort of creepy and stalker-like in other situations. Um, but he was one of the most interesting individuals I've ever had the pleasure to sit with. Um, and um, and uh, and then it was just um, uh, every day kind of became one for me because I was just in this office the whole time by myself with like the voice of Adam, you know, talking to me through a speaker. Um, but it was very pleasurable, you know. I mean, this this is the way that uh, 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 that Mike Burry likes to work, uh, in solitude. It's the way that his brain is at its most, at its peak, which is a phenomenal brain. Um, and um, it, it, was, it was just a pleasure from beginning to end. Adam creates this great vibe on the set of wonderful humor, but, in, but also sort of heartbreaking poignancy. Um, and, uh, and, and it's all accessible, you know, it's all understandable as well. Uh, I've been playing a game with a lot of people in Hollywood, and because I rarely get to talk to you, I'm going to play a little bit with you. It's called uh, Save or Kill. It's a personality test. What would you like to save between two things? Uh, Star Wars or Star Trek? I would save Star Wars. I've still got the figures. Um, I've, 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 I've passed them on to my daughter. Yeah, I would save Star Wars. Uh, the Wire or Mad Men? Haven't seen either. Uh, <laughs> ga game of Thrones or Breaking Bad? Uh, Breaking Bad. Are we saying save? Yeah. Yep. Uh, Zelda or Mario? Mario. Uh, Han Solo or Indiana Jones? Han Solo. Uh, the Beatles or Rolling Stones? Rolling Stones. I like how decisive you are. Harry Potter or Lord of the Rings? Lord of the Rings. Uh, Iron Man or Captain America? Uh, don't really care. Uh, Sync or Backstreet Boys? No, get rid of both of <laughs> them. Uh, uh, Iron, wait, uh, Twilight or Fifty Shades of Grey? Uh, no idea. <laughs> uh, no, no interest in either. Alfred or Yoda? Oh man, that is the trickiest one. Oh, Since I've killed both on others, can I please save both? There? Sure, I'll let you have a I want, I want, I want Alfred with Yoda sitting on his head. Uh, Back to the Future or Ghostbusters? Um, ew. That's a tricky one, isn't it? I th I'm, I'm, I've got to go save... Uh, I haven't seen it for years, but I've got to say Back to the Future, because I think it was the first film that I ever went to see by myself. Oh, uh, Michael Jackson or Prince? It's a tough one. <laughs> You're giving me that look. Uh, save... Oh, save Prince. I, my last two. Woody Allen or Mel Brooks? This is, this is a funny one, isn't it? All right. Um, Mel Brooks. And save Mel Brooks. Sure. Seinfeld or Friends? Oh, come on. Seinfeld, but mostly because um, uh, 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 for me, I didn't actually uh, grow up in England. I didn't watch Seinfeld, but I just love Larry David and Kirby too. So with the connection there, absolutely. Yeah. No Thank you so no much for playing. Sense. Congratulations right, on this movie. <laughs> hey guys, if you like this video, click the thumbs up button. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. It'll help you stay up to date with everything we've got going on here at Collider.